Happy New Year Capricorn. This is Rosemary coming to you from Ansar Angels. This angel scope is for both Capricorn Sun and Capricorn Moon. These are your January 2014 angel answers from your Capricorn angel Hanael who resides over Cardinal Earth. December leaves the goat with the phrase, I can't go to all these parties since the social gatherings are not yet done for this holiday season. Libra the Scales and Taurus the Bull provide an enormous amount of emotional support with Leos becoming important in business or work environments. Abandonment is the issue this month as the new year begins. Don't forget that the year of the horse takes over on January 31st, 2014 bringing quicker paces and sharp focus on goals set. Goals have been sharpened to very precise and specific outcomes. There is not really any need for guesswork when all the bricks have been put into place with strong mortar and mathematical certainty. Those who have built houses of cards will find that the strong, brisk winds of 2014 sweep away all they think they have built. Love matters have unfolded for the goat in such a way as to bring out the best in you Capricorn. Children are probable for younger couples and establishing abundant home environments is very likely this month. Establishing comfort and luxury is the focus for you in January. There has been pressure and stress in your emotional life but you have been able to balance things and come out ahead by removing the people and situations from your life that you find unpleasant or wasteful. This has been a good plan, leaving you with the emotional support of people you trust and share mutual values and goals with. Money matters will be extremely successful in January. Your angel allows for abundant solar aspects this month that allow the kind of business and financial gain you truly desire. Don't allow the defensive ego of others to get in your way Capricorn. Keep chanting to yourself, don't get mad, get rich. And you will do well. Your courage is appreciated and it has gained you a healthy following of friends. Loyalty is not really the point in financial matters for you this month. Capricorn has become keenly aware that success is not determined by what you know, but you have found that rather it's who you have access to and what you have control of. That's what counts, and this is the key to your gaining money, assets, and property in the new year. Health matters need not concern you this month. Your health is naturally blessed with an almost miraculous ability to instantly recuperate from overwork or copious amounts of your vice of choice. The health of spouses though may be difficult in January. They will need your support. Also an important consideration Capricorn is that January is not a good time to consider getting married if you are already divorced. You may have been feeling that you have lost some of your personal power and authority over your own fate and the fate of those you care about in recent months. This will pass and your more familiar traits of holding power will return if you play your cards right starting this month. Now the key to playing your cards right is to build clout. Influence is the key to control and power. Money is just one way to achieve clout. After all, it's the cook who has the power over the meal that is served, not the one being served. Your divine tone of I use gives you the ability to build a storehouse of treasures in January. Thank you for watching, listening Capricorn, and we will see you next month.